<sighs> yeah, I know they're still here. Well, yesterday I had some other things to do. So, unfortunately, you did not get to see the Revenge Destroy like usual. Like usual. But, I do have to talk about this on why these are going to be Revenge Destroyed. So, I decided to talk to this one woman, and lo and behold, my roommate decided to think that it was wise to spy on my conversations online by standing over my shoulder. And little did I know he was going to do this to start harassing her to try to defame me. However, at first it sounded like that it didn't work, but it ended up working. Because lo and behold, she decided to say that, that me and her were creeping her out. But I can tell you one thing. You, his problems, and I can tell, his problems are not my problems. And he tries to talk about how I don't care about his problems. But he tried to drag her into some bullshit that happens here. And... Because he continued to harass her after the fact that she decided to block me because of what goes on between me and my roommate, she decides to threaten legal action because of what he's doing. And she says how me and him should work out our problems. Well, here's the thing. He refuses to work out problems. I've been trying to get these problems fixed. And whatever he was saying to her sounded like it would really piss her off. And he was trying to lie to me saying that Oh, she's going to get it. All, all that legal action is going to be put on you. And I got to say that's bullshit because you are the one doing the harassment, dude. You are the one who is constantly bothering her about me. You are the one who made it so that she doesn't like me anymore. You ruined the friendship between me and and that woman and I hope you can live with that so needless to say next Tuesday your classic Sonic your Werehog your little general guy and your Venom action figures are going to be roadkill and he decides that oh well ha 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 I was right and he's telling this lady this thing all this shit and I hear him say cause he usually talks he's that kind of person who talks when they type what they say when they're typing it so, and you know what? I hope she does proceed with the kind of action. Because you know what? I put up with your shit for three fucking years. And I will be happy to testify against you. And I will be happy to know that you will no longer have a place here if legal action has been taken by her. 
And he's gonna probably try to harass her more about that because he's gonna try to say, oh, well, you're gonna go after the innocent one and you fucking know it, and then you... Trust me, I hope he does admit that he's the only one that should be the guy that goes in prison. But then again... I don't know. I haven't really did anything to warrant her to do any to put legal action against me. I mean, I didn't threaten the lady. All I did was ask for an explanation why she blocked me on a using a different account. But I ended up deleting the account and I said, "Fine, you don't like that I wanted it. Well, I said pretty much, you want me to leave you alone? Fine, I'll leave you alone. But what does the roommate do? He constantly bothers her. He'll make account after account. And he did this, and I'm glad that she threatened him with legal action. I'm pretty sure he was just trying to bullshit me, trying to say that. I was the one that she was going to try to pursue and that I that it was only me. Come on, dude. We all know you're full of shit. Oh. By the way. Remember this? There's the Super Nintendo. You decided to hit with a hammer right in the front. Right. There's the, you see the crack? He slammed it with a, he smashed it with a hammer that he owns. And then he threw it to the ground so hard it stopped working and it was on when he did it it's a nice job dude you almost burned the damn house to the ground so most people say oh we want proof that he did it well here's the proof anything else he pretty much just threw away well, he was so stupid to leave this. So, I'm pretty sure that judge is going to love to hear that what you're doing because I have people over. And you know what? Just admit it, dude. You're jealous. You're jealous that I had a female friend. Just admit it and we could all sleep easy at easily at night but trying to can't speak today I'm tired I was out partying and getting laid because I don't piss away my 20s like your fucking ass did you you're so bad that not even your adoptive parents want you anymore You're so bad that you can't even get friends, not even at work. Why do you think that they're threatening to fire you? Well, maybe you should watch your mouth and keep your hands to yourself. But, over there, those are going to be gone.
They're gonna be roadkill. There ain't nothing you're gonna do about it. Cause it ain't gonna be all happening outside from here. Oh, by the way, you owe me a new pelican. Just saying. You dirty prick. So, that was kind of an explanation to why there was supposed to be a revenge destroy yesterday. And here's your proof on what he does to my stuff. Oh. There's the part he tried to cut of my GameCube controller. Now the damn thing doesn't work. You owe me a new GameCube controller too, motherfucker. But he'll never watch these videos and he knows that he won't. Oh, there's, the, there's another cut too. So yeah, you owe me a new GameCube controller. Oh, and another cut. This is a motherboard to something. Oh, y'all, this is, you also owe me a new DVD player, too. Oh, here's another GameCube controller he tried to cut. Oh, my DSi. Y'all hear another one of that. You know, I have a 3DS. You broke that too. There's the motherboard, part of the motherboard. Part of a TV I bought. What's this? Um.
most recent thing you destroyed. A Samsung charger cord. Nice try. Hold on. Yeah, still recording. But, what else did you break? Oh, by the way, that small TV was a hand-me-down, so yeah. That's nice. That's nice that you destroy someone else's property that I had in my possession. Well, you're lucky I was able to fix this. Oh, that's the plug. That still works. So, yeah. Oh, and you almost tried to smash my box fans, too. So that's fucking nice while they were on. So again, thanks for trying to burn down the house, motherfucker. So, yeah. That's a little bit of an explanation to why there was supposed to be a Revenge Destroy Tuesday. Well, expect that video next Tuesday or the following week. Because I'm getting sick of his shit. And I can tell you one thing right now. My lease is set to expire soon. So I'm not going to sign the lease. In fact, once I don't once I have the lease renewal, I'm just going to say, no, I'm not renewing the lease at all. Because once I'm on, off the lease, for the time being, they say, because they want people who aren't able to constantly, who they want people who will hang out around at home pretty much and I'm not really there I'm not really here all the time cause you know I'm 24 years old and I don't have to deal with the, your bullshit alright you're 36 what's your excuse you're just pissed that you don't have a good job and your job is shit Oh, and then, oh, well, you got in trouble at work. And then tried to bring me involved. I didn't, I'm not the reason why you got in trouble at work. I'm not the reason why they cut your hours, which I hate that they did that. Because that means they have, that I have to deal with your shit more. But, yeah, there ain't going to be... But kiss your little favorite action figures goodbye because you ain't going to see them anymore after next week. So, this kind, this kind of concludes the video. Sorry it took that long. But 
but I had to explain what the hell was going on. And I'll be happy to testify against you as a witness. If she's willing to use me as a witness. But you know, that would be a good thing because then I'll be on witness protection. Which would mean I wouldn't have to live here. Nor would I be able to. But like I said, I have... Three more months on... Well, no. I'm wrong. That would be in... December. When I have three more months left. But, you know what I'm trying to say. I had... My lease is about set to expire. I'm not gonna renew it. Because... I'm not always here anyway. So, once the contract has been terminated then that means I can move out whenever I want after once I get a better job and not have to rely on fucking GameStop cause GameStop likes to treat their employees like shit and underpay their employees and I should have listened to all these rant videos but that's another video. Alright, see ya.